This is a world's first, and let me tell you, we are excited, and we're gonna show you a few little features and benefits of that here today. Glenn, we've been lucky enough to sneak out of the office for a little bit to spend some time on this new Hellmaster EX system. I'm pretty excited about it. You spent a fair bit of time testing it in the USA. What are we dealing with here? Yeah, this is exciting, Grant. When we got back, uh, I couldn't wait to get you out on the water, which is here today. But this system, it's totally new, but it's not just a, it's not a new engine, which we're all familiar with launching. This is a new product, which is in the boat, making boat easier. It's from the steering right through to the control system, new controls, but most importantly, something that we've asked for for a long time, and that's Yamaha's own integrated autopilot as well. Now, we've always had Hellmaster on our twin engine boats. The most exciting part about this Hellmaster EX system is we can actually use this on a single engine boat. Um, explain how that's going to work. Yeah, look, this is exciting for us. We've always wanted something for single engines. Hellmaster, traditionally for twin engines, triples or quads, but it gave us some new abilities while we're fishing, which is our fish point, our drift point, and our actually stay point features. I mean, what those features can do is for the fishermen, as you arrive onto the spot, you've got the ability to engage where the engines will actually hold you on the mark, but you have fish point, which will allow you to quieten the engines down, but hold the stern onto your fishing point. But now with the ability to do that with a single motor, I mean, this is a world's first. And let me tell you, we are excited and we're gonna show you a few little features and benefits of that here today. So at the first level of our Hellmaster EX system, we have our digital electronic controls. Tell us a bit about that, Glenn. Yeah, it's a new control and it is feature rich, Grant. We could spend all day really just talking about it on its own, but just the good new features is it's got a control control, it has speed control, it's got a new ergonomic feel, but most importantly, when it's a twin, triple or quad application, we've also now got single lever operations, meaning that you can operate all the engines, but just on a single lever. We're down the back of the boat now. I'm looking at the engine, Glenn, and I can see something there that's completely new. You're absolutely right, Grant. It is a fully electric steering cylinder. So what it is, is it's completely electric. It is easy to install. It is very low maintenance, but most importantly, it enables our complete Hellmaster EX system to operate. The next level of the expandable system is the autopilot. The autopilot ties in nicely with our fully digital steering, but some really cool features of the autopilot is heading hold and course hold. So that is to set your track and to get there with the least amount of uh, moving off course, which is going to get you there faster. Another great feature of the autopilot is track point. That gives you the ability to tie it in with your MFD display and use your MFD to be able to set your waypoint destination hit track point and you're off and you're going to arrive at that destination as you've marked with your GPS. And we've also got our pattern steer feature, which you can set those adjustments on your multifunction display to move around a fishing area while watching the depth sounder to get you right onto the mark that you're looking for. We're now at the biggest feature of the Hellmaster EX system, and that is the joystick, or otherwise known as the maneuverability system. It is also your control unit for fish point. It is your control unit for drift point and stay point. And with those point features that you're using, you can actually use the joystick to tightly maneuver it and make it a better experience. Grant, we're talking a single engine here with a joystick, so we now know how revolutionary that really is. But have a go at us here, being able to manoeuvre around in this marina, being able to, you know, push it forward for more acceleration or turn it, having the ability also to go back into reverse and steer around where it's needed most. But that's what makes this system so fantastic and so revolutionary is the fact that we are talking about something that is totally new, and that is the digital electric steering. So actually, take your hand off the joystick, goes back to neutral with 
no throttle. And then simply apply the throttle again by a forward motion. We're now accelerating away and nothing more than a slight twist of the joystick to be able to steer around the marina. So what you see here, Grant, I'm going to come into this jetty on the joystick alone, but how easy is this and not having to jostle with the steering wheel and throttle to be able to do the perfect part? We just come in on approach, we steer in nice and easy. We're going to go into reverse now and steer the back of the boat in. And look at that. So we just put up at the Marina Glen, we thought we'd take the chance to talk about this digital electric steering. Now you're a technical kind of guy, what does this mean for, for te tech heads out there? Yeah, that's good, it's a really good question because from the installation point of view of this and to have this amount of features is not done before. You've got an electric cylinder, okay, now in previous times to have an electric cylinder you have to have an electric pump which means the complication of hydraulic lines and then further hydraulic lines going from the pump to the helm. What you've also then had is a constant power draw, so it's excited, it's ready that when you turn the wheel, that it's uh, powered and ready to go. But this system's completely different. We've cleaned up the back of the boat, so we've got nothing hidden in the side pockets, opening up the boat for the consumer. But from an installation then point of view, it is easy to install. So it's, it's a real advancement from anything that we've ever seen before. It, it, power drawer I spoke about with the old electric system, it only draws power when it actually is in use. So statically and idle here now, it's, it's no power draw whatsoever. So there's no need for more battery power or another battery, which some people might think there is. All right, so that's the tech heads covered, but what is this actually gonna mean for the skipper? Yeah, there is lots of adjustments on this that's available to be set during the installation or the technical settings as we call them. That is the amount of turns that you need for lock to lock. It can be anywhere from four turns, five, six, seven, eight, nine turns lock to lock. Also the ability to tighten up the friction of it a little bit. So if you find that it's a little bit easier on the wheel, got the ability to put a little bit more friction on. And that's also got the ability to be variable. So you could have more friction at higher speed allowing you to have more control over the boat, especially a smaller trailer boat like this. They are some really cool features. Glenn, this joystick control is so great around this marina, but I can't wait to get out and see what else this Hellmaster EX system can do. Yeah, so let's get out of here and I'm gonna show you some really cool features, but let's start with autopilot. So Glenn, this new Yamaha Autopilot is a really exciting part of Hellmaster EX. What is this going to mean for fishermen? Autopilot is such a cool feature. It gives us the ability to go into our GPS, we can plot a course, hit a destination that we want to get to, and we can hit go to, and it will take us there on the shortest possible track. But this does something actually even that little bit more. On approach to our final destination, it will actually automatically decelerate the motor, but then when we get to the spot, I'm gonna show you something that is really cool that you've never been able to do before with a single engine. All right, sounds good, let's see it. So Grant, to kick this off, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna hit our go-to destination. So we're gonna hit there. Now we're gonna hit go-to, we're gonna activate track point, and we're gonna accelerate away. Look at the boat steering onto our course to get us to our destination. How cool is that? So Grant, what you've just seen then is on approach to our final destination, the motor has decelerated on its own and that's allowing us as the skipper also to understand that we are on approach. So Grant, this is the piece that I've been waiting to show you. You can now hear that we've arrived at our final destination. So I'm gonna bring the lever back to neutral and as we do so, we activate fish point.
So Glenn, you mentioned Fish Point. Now that's a feature we've seen on previous variations of Hellmaster. But what makes Fish Point on this setup so unique? Well, for a start, it's a single engine. So this is a world first. But to have the ability with one engine to sit here and hold us in a position is quite unique. But with the digital steering, along with the digital control, that's what's allowing the engine to move while using throttle and also going into forward and reverse to hold us here. But what's making us hold here is a GPS aerial on the roof. So with the GPS aerial holding us in the location, right, it's just a perfect match. So we can find our fishing spot, hit a button, and we're fishing. How good is it though, seriously? Like this is less time mucking around. You know what I call this? More fun. Glenn, this is really incredible. We're sitting out here with a fair bit of wind and tide, but we've hardly moved. Yeah, you can talk about this, you can read about it, but the real wow factor is coming out and seeing it for yourself. Yeah, you're spot on. So we've chosen our spot here. We've hit fish points, so we're holding in position. But what if we want to move a little bit close to that beacon, which is about 10 metres away? Well, you'd think we'd have to disengage fish point and actually manually drive the boat over there, but it's not the case. With the joystick, we're able to fine tune. So one bump of the joystick to the port side, we're going to move in the port direction by three metres. So all I'm going to do is bump it twice, which will move us six metres closer to our target. You can see that we're now moving towards our new target by just using forward and reverse with the smallest amount of throttle to slowly walk us across to our new target. The conditions today are pretty friendly. What happens if we're working in some more ugly wind and tide? Yeah, look, a really good question and an easy answer is just simply by using the thrust up button that's on the joystick. What we've done now is just gone from level two to a level five. So we are now telling the motor that it's okay to use more effort to get to our target. Glenn, this is amazing. This is a world first, and it's amazing to see the way that the Apple now integrates in the, into the complete boat system. Yeah, this is what it's all about. Hellmaster EX. It's a boat system. It's not just for the outboard motor. It is for the captain. It is for the skipper to make their boating experience easier, which is more time on the water, having more fun. So today we've spoken about the point features of a single engine. So we have a fish point mode, which we've gone through, but now this is drift point. The idea of drift point is so we right now are drifting with the wind and tide. It's taking us in the direction we want to go. What we have the ability to do with the joystick now is to change the direction of the bow and stern of the boat to drift in a particular way so we can comfortably fish out the side. Another really awesome feature of Yamaha's autopilot is the ability to adjust it into a zigzag or a spiral pattern. So you can imagine you have a fishing area, but you don't actually know where the reef is. Using these features, we can zigzag across the reef, how I'll set this one up, actually then locate your fishing spot before then you enter fish point, which is then gonna stop the boat, hold you on the mark, and we're fishing straight away without anchoring or sea anchoring. Yeah, awesome. Glenn, that was incredible. I'm amazed at the things you can now do with a single engine. This really is a world first. Yeah, this is Hellmaster EX. It is going to make your boating more enjoyable and it will change the way that you use your boat. Well, Glenn, that was a cracking day in the water and everything we did today was with a single engine. Pretty incredible. And we just scratched the surface of the new technology with this Hellmaster EX system. And I mean, you can imagine what we're going to uncover with the twin system as well. But look, it is just perfect for the fishing in Australian and New Zealand waters. And I, for one, cannot wait to get out there and start using it. Yeah, it's going to be great. We're going to get back out there. There's going to be a lot more information coming on our website and across our social media channels. We're going to one of our dealerships across the country. 